In this video, we're gonna show you how to convert your eye candy peach carry cot into a seat. First thing you wanna do is remove your belly bar by pushing the button in and releasing. And then removing your canopy by pressing this button here on both sides and then unzipping the zipper. If you have your apron attached, remove your apron as well by pressing the press studs and lifting the canopy off. You will be reusing this canopy and the belly bar that we've just removed. Unzip the apron if you are using it. And remember to give that a little wash before you store it away. Remove the mattress, and if you are using a waterproof protector and a fitted sheet, make sure you wash that as well before storing. As well as the white internal lining that I'm removing now by undoing the white zipper. And pushing that out. What you would like to do now is unzip the zipper on both sides by undoing the zipper here and undoing the zipper on the bottom. Inside the caricot fabric, there are two bars. What you're going to do is pull these bars out, putting your finger inside the strap and pushing down like so. Doing that on both sides. And you'll see that your bassinet will fall down. You're going to pull these bars out and pop them away. And then you'll notice that all you have now is the base fabric and frame. Take your base out of the fabric. In the box with the pram, you'll notice that you get a little black key that says eye candy. This key is going to allow you to pull the frame apart to remove the fabric and then set it up as a seat. So take this little key out, which is in a piece of plastic with your warranty instruction booklet. Take the key, and what you're going to do is push these little silver pins in. There is one on both sides, closest to the bottom of the frame. Push the key in to release the frame and you'll feel it move out slowly. And the bottom half of the frame will come undone. Like so, we're going to use this frame again, as well as the top piece. And then you can store your carry cot fabric away now with that little key. To set your seat fabric up, take the two parts of the frame again and sit them just in the same position as you had them before. Now making sure that the zippers are always on top and not on the bottom facing down. Place them like that and grab your seat fabric. Place your seat fabric inside the frame like this. Now the most important part that you need to remember when setting up your seat fabric is you need to make sure that these two pieces of fabric on both sides are fed through the frame as this will support the child's weight. You'll see just above the zipper, there's a little slot for the fabric to slide through. Get the piece of fabric and slide it inside the frame on both sides before you attach both frames with each other. At this stage, what you might wanna do as well is get the bottom zipper and attach that zipper to the seat fabric piece, just putting it on slightly and then clipping your frame together. Now, finish doing the zipper up. 
on the bottom. Doing the zipper up on top. Grabbing your canopy back out, placing the canopy in the little canopy slot on both sides and then doing the zipper up. And lastly, grabbing your belly bar and sliding that in. You may want to, as you start to transition from the carry cot to the seat, also buying a seat liner as the seat liners are machine washable, placing them inside the seat to keep it clean. And that's how you transition your carry cot to a seat. When you are using the seat, some of the features that you can now use is pressing the button at the back, which will recline and sit the seat in an upright position. There's four different positions you can choose, as well as pressing these buttons on both sides to place your child's feet up or down. Remembering that when you are reclining the seat on the eye candy peach, you need to fully engage the button before you put it into a recline position by pressing in like so and pushing before forcing it down into a recline position. And that's how you transition from a carry cot to a seat.